Today we're gonna to be making potato grandes. Now, you might call it a taco potato. Some people call them Mexican potatoes. Uh, essentially, it's a baked potato that's filled with taco meat and all that good stuff. And our family has been calling them potato grandes for more than 30 years. And that's because of a local establishment several years ago that used to have this on their menu. And that's what they called it potato grande. Let's have some fun. So we start with four large russet potatoes. We're going to poke a few holes in the top to allow the steam to escape and also to save from a possible potato explosion in the oven. We coat the potatoes with oil and a coarse salt and we'll bake them at 400 degrees for one hour or until an internal temp of 212. So now we have one onion and one pound of hamburger. We're going to begin to work that in together. And then once the hamburger is brown, we'll drain it. And then we'll add our seasoning, salt and pepper, and one cup of water. We'll begin to stir that in together and let it simmer for about 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, it should be ready. Remove the baked potatoes from the oven after one hour, and they should be ready for topping. Cut open the baked potato, and then we'll squeeze it from both ends and try to fluff it up the best we can. And we want to create uh, a little well inside the potato. Then we'll start off with salt and pepper to taste. Then we add our butter. Next, we wanna start with our taco mixture and then some sour cream, some salsa. And then I use the Taco Bell hot sauce. Use the hot sauce that you want to use. I just happen to like this. I then went with some cheddar cheese and then some green onion for topping and this thing is ready to go. So whether you call it Mexican potatoes, taco potatoes, potato grandes, none of that really matters. All that matters is, is it good? Well, that looks good enough to eat.